Get out. Okay. Okay, there. I'm on it. Be careful. I got Damn ladder broke off the wall. Now what? I'll figure something out. Let me go ahead, and you follow my lead. Okay, right behind you. Ah. Okay, come on, jump. You're gonna catch me? I got you. Didn't even need me. Let's get the hell off this thing.
Hands in the air! She's not breathing. Hands in the fucking air! Come on, man. Welcome to the Fireflies. Sorry about that. They didn't know who you were. And Ellie? She's all right. They brought her back. <sighs> you came all this way. How'd you do it? It was her. <clears throat> she fought like hell to get here. Maybe it was meant to be. I lost most of my crew crossing the country. I pretty much lost everything. And then you show up, and somehow we find you just in time to save her. Maybe it was meant to be. Take me to her. You don't have to worry about her anymore. We'll take care I of her. I worry. Just let me see her, please. You can't. She's being prepped for surgery. The hell do you mean, surgery? The doctors tell me the cordyceps, the growth inside her, has somehow mutated. It's why she's immune. Once they remove it, they'll be able to reverse engineer a vaccine. A vaccine. But it grows all over the brain. It does. Find someone else. There is no one else. Listen, you were gonna show me where she... Stop. I get it. But whatever it is you think you're going through right now is nothing to what I have been through. I knew her since she was born. I promised your mother I would look after her. Then why are you letting this happen? Because this isn't about me. Or even her. There is no other choice here. March him out of here. He tries anything, shoot him. Don't waste this gift, Joe. Get up. I said get up. I said move. Give me an excuse. Which way? What the fuck are you doing? Keep walking. I said keep walking. <laughs> Where is the operating room? I ain't got time for this. Where? Where? Top floor, the far end.
Got any surprises for me? Huh? Son of a bitch! <laughs>
It's 5.30 p.m. on April 28th. I just finished speaking, I don't know, more like yelling at our head surgeon. Apparently, there's no way to extricate the parasite without eliminating the host. Fancy way of saying we gotta kill the fucking kid. And now they're asking for my go-ahead. The tests just keep getting harder and harder, don't they? I'm so tired. I'm exhausted. And I just want this to end. So be it. April 28. Marlene was right. The girl's infection is like nothing I've ever seen. The cause of her immunity is uncertain. As we've seen in all past cases, the antigenic titers of the patient's cordyceps remain high in both the serum and the cerebrospinal fluid. Blood cultures taken from the patient rapidly grow cordyceps and fungal media in the lab. However, white blood cell lines, including percentages and absolute counts, are completely normal. There is no elevation of pro-inflammatory cytokines, and an MRI of the brain shows no evidence of fungal growth in the limbic regions, which would normally accompany the prodrome of aggression in infected patients. We must find a way to replicate this state under laboratory conditions. We're about to hit a milestone in human history equal to the discovery of penicillin. After years of wandering in circles, we're about to come home. Make a difference and bring the human race back into control of its own destiny. All of our sacrifices and the hundreds of men and women who've bled for this cause, or worse, will not be in vain. I'm coming.
Don't let him get to the kid! You're gonna pay for that, asshole! Jesus. It's been a while since we spoke. I, uh, I just gave the okay to proceed with the surgery. I really doubt I had much of a choice. Asking me was more of a formality. I need you to know that I've kept my promise all these years. Despite everything that I was in charge of, I looked after her. I would have done anything for her, and at times... I a chance to save us. All of us. This is what we were after. What you were after. They asked me to kill the smuggler. I'm not about to kill the one man in this facility that might understand the weight of this choice. Maybe he can forgive me. Your daughter will be with you soon. This is our future.
You can't save her. Even if you get her out of here, then what? How long before she's torn to pieces by a pack of clickers? That is, if she hasn't been raped and murdered first. <laughs> that ain't for you to decide. It's what she'd want. And you know it. Look. You can still do the right thing here. She won't feel anything. are still wearing off. What happened? We found the fireflies. Turns out there's a whole lot more like you, Ellie. People that are immune. There's dozens, actually. Ain't done a damn bit of good, neither. They've actually... They've stopped looking for a cure. I'm taking this home. I'm sorry. Like we're walking. Should be a straight shot through here. All right. It's actually kind of pretty, ain't it? Yeah. All right. Now watch your head going through. now. I don't think I ever told you, but uh, Sarah and I used to take hikes like this. I think, uh, I think the two of you would have been, would have been good friends. I think you really would have liked her. I know she'd have liked you. I bet I would have. further now. Back in Boston? Back when I was bitten? I wasn't alone. 
My best friend was there. And she got bit too. We didn't know what to do. So... She says... Let's just wait it out. You know, we can be all poetic and just lose our minds together. I'm still waiting for my turn. Ellie. Her name was Riley, and she was the first to die. And then it was Tess. And then Sam. None of that is on you. You don't understand. I struggled for a long time with surviving. And you... No matter what... You keep finding something to fight for. Now, I know that's not what you want to hear right now. Swear now, to me. Swear to me that everything that you've said about the Fireflies is true. I swear. Stop the madness!